According to the instructions of Kondinya Muni, the husband and wife duly observed this Parma Ikadashi. When the vows of Ikadashi and Pancharatri were completed, a prince from the royal palace came there. Being inspired by Brahma, the prince offered Sumedha and Pavitra a new house decorated with beautiful royal furniture. Well, that's wonderful. He gave them a cow for their livelihood. And after praising the Brahmin couple, the prince left. As a result of this, the prince returned to the abode of Vishnu at the end of his life. As the Brahmanas are the best among the human beings, cows are the best of the four-legged animals, Indra is the best among demigods, leap year is the best among all months. Within this month, the two ecodices, Padmini and Parama, are most dear to Hari. If after receiving human form, one does not observe Ikadashi, then he never attains any happiness throughout throughout the 8,400,000 species of life. Rather, he suffers unlimited miseries. The vir- by virtue of great piety, one obtains a human birth. Therefore, one should certainly observe the vow of Ikadashi. After hearing the glories of this Ikadashi, Yudhishthira, along with his wife and brothers, observed this sacred Ikadashi. The first sentence that Krishna said was, the procedure for observing this ikadasi is the same as I already described to you for the previous ikadasi, which we, to remind you, it talks about not eating spinach on dasami and feeding Vaishnavas and Brahmanas on dwadasi.